How is otitis media diffusion, or glue ear, diagnosed? The exact cause of glue ear is not entirely clear, but doctors believe it is linked to the dysfunction of the eustachian tube. Normally, the eustachian tube helps to maintain equal air pressure on both sides of the eardrum. When this tube becomes blocked, it leads to a drop in the air pressure within the middle ear. Consequently, fluid from the surrounding tissues fills up the middle ear. Over time, this fluid becomes thick and sticky and hinders the normal vibrations of the eardrum and ossicles. When you bring your child to hospital for assessment, clinicians will examine your child's ear to check for visible blockages in the ear canals and to assess the appearance of the eardrum. After that, the clinicians will conduct hearing tests to determine if there's any hearing loss and if so, whether glue ear is the cause. One of these tests, called tympanometry, assesses the eardrum's mobility and provides an indication of the presence of glue ear.